Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the Timu DIY Advent Calendar collaboration. I'm very excited about this collaboration. This uh, wonderful idea was put together by Jessie Miller of Boxings and More. Her idea was for us to create an advent calendar where we have 12 items for the 12 days of Christmas and all of the items will cost less than $15 bought from Timu. I'm gonna show you 12 items that I chose for my own personal use but we also put together our own DIY advent calendar that will be the giveaway item for one of you guys. It'll have 12 different items bought from Timu. The total cost will be under $15. And I gotta say, there's a lot of items on Timu that are very low price. And so there was a lot of different items to choose from and Jesse gave us complete free range so we could buy from any different category, any different item, and the items could cost however much as long as you didn't spend more than $15 for the 12 overall. For the rules of this giveaway, you need to be 18 years or older, you need to live within the United States, and you need to be publicly subscribed to everyone who is part of this collaboration. And you have to comment on all of their videos. You do not have to enter all of their giveaways so if you don't want to use their code word if you don't want to enter their giveaways you don't have to but you do have to at least comment on everybody's video the seven people who are in this collab is jesse miller unboxings and more reviews with sue katie's corner of the world miss jackie russell favorites with laura mary Catherine loves cats and myself laura wooten reviews we are the seven people who are part of this collab and you have an opportunity to win a 12 day diy advent calendar from one of us you can only win one advent calendar giveaway. You also have to use the code word that'll be shared in the video. My code word is going to be present. Just use that in the comments down below and that'll enter you into my personal giveaway of my advent calendar. For my advent calendar, you will get 12 wrapped items with a number on each one. I'm still in the process of putting it together so that you can open them up for each day or however you wanna do it. The giveaway does start today and it ends on November 26th, so we are giving people more time to watch all the videos and to make their comments. Whenever we announce the giveaways, you will need to respond quickly so that we can get it mailed out to you and you can actually receive it before December 13th so that you can open it for the 12 days of Christmas if that's what you choose. I do have a box, a little Christmassy type box of the 12 different items that I picked out that I'm keeping for myself. I'm gonna start off with this cute little penguin. But this is just a little pocket penguin. He says, here's a hug while I can't be there. Put me in your pocket and take me everywhere. I've never seen one of these, but it was something that was really, really cute. It was only 89 cents. I do have to say, when I picked out my first 12 items for me, I was kind of all over the place when picking out items. They're very random. They don't really all go together. However, whenever I picked out the next 12 items for the advent calendar, that is more of a cohesive advent calendar put together. And that one will have items that I do believe a variety of our viewers are going to want. So just keep in mind that the items I'm showing you now are not necessarily going to be the items that you receive in your advent calendar. I want the advent calendar to be a surprise so you won't get to see those items. All right, the next item I have is this cute little reindeer. I think it's a reindeer pin because on the back of it, it has the little pin thing here. But that's really cute and it was only $1.34 for that little plush reindeer here. The next item I got <laughs> is a stress ball. So it looks like this, as if you had buns that were steaming in here. And the little bun is actually really cute looks like a little bun or dumpling and it's just a squeezy ball you know you just squeeze it for stress it actually feels really soft this was a dollar 48 for a stress ball I think pretty good quality and I like the little package that it came on all right the next item I have this item that I will get use out of it's a little back scratcher and I think it does extend so if you need it to be longer you can but yeah Back scratchers come in handy. This was only 98 cents. I do like the little tips here. They're not too sharp. It'll give you a nice scratch, but it won't hurt you. Yeah, like I said, random items <laughs> for my 12. All right, the next item that I have is another penguin type item. I did get myself several penguin type things because I just really love penguins. This one is a necklace. 
and I love it because it says I love you to the moon and back. I love the blues. The little penguin is sleeping. He's all bundled up. And this necklace only cost 98 cents, which I thought was a really good value as far as jewelry goes. Of course, it's not made with any precious metals or anything like that, but still a cute design. The next item I got was a bracelet. And this bracelet cost 97 cents. Here's what it looks like. I love how shiny and vibrant blue it is. It's got the flower, the little ball right here. Hopefully the lighting is picking up on all the shimmers because it's actually really, really pretty. Easy enough to just slip on right here. Pretty good bracelet for only 97 cents. We've made it halfway through my little advent here for me. The next item is this thing of slime, which I'm actually gonna give to my daughter. She is slime obsessed, but I was happy to find slime for $1.79. If you guys have any kids or grandkids that are obsessed with slime, this may be a way to go. It's called Butter Slime. Zaylee, you wanna come test it out? Have our little slime expert come over here and tell you if she thinks it's worth $1.79, if I can open it. These nails are from Timu. <laughs> yeah, it did come with all this stuff that you can add into the slime. That is probably something she will actually do. It's like a, a grape charm, some grape female slices, and some sprinkles. It has a grape scent. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna show them the thing in the tub, but okay. How does it work? Um, it's a bit stiff, but it smells a lot better than all like a the other times that I purchased from Timu. That's good. So a bit stiff, but for less than two dollars, good. A, it's a really good. Oh, yeah. all right. You can take off with your slime. She buys slime from Peachy Babies. It's like some kind of YouTube thing. I don't know. It's like twelve to fifteen dollars for that slime. This is a pretty good, affordable price. All right. Next item that I have in here is this random cloud. Oh, and this little cloud is actually. A little cutter has like a little cutter box for box opening and stuff I do have my hand safely out of the way so don't worry slide this over whenever you want the knife to come out should be able to just cut stuff in a cute little cloud shape let's see how much was this the cloud knife it was like 97 cents pretty affordable all right the next item that I have I was actually able to find a pair of knitted gloves and this I was excited about because the gloves were only $1.97, which is very affordable. And they're the kind of gloves that you wear to keep your hands warm, but you still have access to your fingers. These are actually really soft. I'm really glad I found these gloves. <laughs> nice. I would say it's a pretty good standard pair of gloves. I've received gloves like this in subscription boxes before, and I wanna say the quality is pretty similar. They don't feel itchy, they feel nice, and they fit my hands just fine. So maybe it's like one size fits all. All right, the next item I have, it's a little bit random, okay? It's just kind of one of those things where I was trying to find anything that would cost less than a dollar, and I came across these little ducks. And I know they're weird, but, they're supposed to like glow in the dark blue or something. I'm just gonna try to put them in the light and then maybe get a picture of them. Okay, here's what the ducks look like when they're clear. And then I'm gonna try to put them against the light so then I can take a picture of them with the lights off and then you can see how they glow blue. Again, I don't know the point of these ducks. I just saw them. I thought they looked cool. They're just like a little trinket thing for maybe someone who really likes ducks. They're cute, but I will admit it is pretty random. Aw, it's lighting up green. They were supposed to be blue. And maybe it's blue whenever it's actually in the door. She just did a little one and it kind of only did green. Okay, the next item I have is actually a poster. This is, I think, day 11 for me. And this poster or picture only cost $1.78. Of course, it doesn't have a frame, so you would have to frame it yourself. This is what it looks like. Again, with the penguins, I told you I found a bunch of penguin stuff. I just really adore penguins. This would be great for a bathroom because, you know, that's where you get naked. And then this little picture of the penguins bathing is just really adorable. Okay, the last thing I have in here for my day 12 is a necklace. The coloring of it looks more gold or rose gold, but this I was really excited about. I thought it was super cute. It is the moon and a star, and I liked it because one, it's just really pretty, but also it kind of reminds me a little bit of Matthew's symbol in the 
All Souls trilogy if you've ever read Discovery of Witches or if you have seen the show Discovery of Witches on HBO. His symbol was a star and a moon. Of course his symbol is actually the star and then the moon underneath it but I thought it was a pretty close representation when I saw it and I just really wanted to get it because I thought it was really cute and I loved the rose gold material that was used. This necklace only cost 98 cents. That was everything in my Timu DIY advent calendar. That was like for me, the 12 items I had picked out for myself. Keep in mind that the 12 items for the DIY advent calendar that I am gifting to you will have different items in it for the most part. And that one will be a little bit more cohesive. It will be something that I think the viewers that watch my channel will like updated pictures of what my advent calendar looks like or has turned into. I will post that on my community pages. That is it for this video, you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. And thank you again to Jesse for putting this whole Timu advent calendar together. It was a brilliant idea. I thought it was really fun and creative. Really goes to show the variety of all the things you can find at Timu. Don't forget to hit the playlist down below so you can see everybody else's videos, watch them, subscribe to them, and comment in their videos. I will be back with another video soon. Bye everyone!